What's up? It's Miguel. And it's Kat. Welcome to CVCC Connect. You know, Kat, no matter how much I make fun of you, I want you to know I sincerely hate you. Oh, wow. That's lovely, Miguel. You know, that wouldn't get you a pickle card. A what? A pickle card. Faith can tell us more. Have you seen Dancing Pickles on Level 1? Don't worry, you're not losing your mind. These pickles represent a program in teaching professions called Pickle Power. It promotes people's acting in a kind way. Teaching professions instructor Miss Everhart talks about how Pickle Power got its name. One day I had a substitute for a, another teacher and her lesson was to show the students a video on customer service. And the video was give them the pickle. So we watched it and we talked about it afterwards. So it all started off as me just subbing and then oh let me help out you know I you know give them something else to do uh, and I made a poster for that class and it, it went over real well. Senior Ryan Hatcher explains what pickle power means to him. Being respectful, caring about other people besides yourself and just being a nice person overall. Uh, it's a good thing to use around the classroom or around school. Senior Shana Rivers tells us how Pickle Power helps CVCC. I was bullied in Leeton, and so I think this is a great way to help slowly put a stop to bullying and help like encourage kids to be more kind. It's, it's a reward. To get your hands on a pickle ticket, reach out, be kind, and help others. Faith Wilson, CVCC Connect. You know, Miguel, you did a really nice job reading that script. Here you go. Oh, thanks. Hey, have you gone to any haunted houses recently for like the spirit of Halloween? No, but I heard that Bloodview is really spooky and they have some great actors. Let's catch up with Jake Armstrong for more on that. CVCC Senior spends his weekends covered in blood. This haunted house is spooky on the outside, but must be sweet on the inside because all funds they raise go straight to charity. We are the oldest improvisational horror acting troupe in the world. And in the past 36 years of operations, um, we have donated over $3 million to charity. Jake likes acting there so much he decided to create his own prop wings. As I started making them and using different materials, they evolved from being like more bird-like wings to being more looking like the Wright Brothers, how it was like the balsa wood and fabric, and yeah. that's what I started basing them off of. So they went kind of from like a demon wings to more of like a steampunk kind of mechanical wings. Not everyone is willing to volunteer to scare people, but to him it's well worth it. Going up there and just blowing off some steam, I get to spend six, seven hours up there just palling around and screaming and yelling and then I'm tired to go home and go to bed and it just, it's just a good way to spend my weekend. Get in the spirit for Halloween and visit Jake at Bloodview this weekend, but be prepared to be scared. Jake Armstrong, CVCC Connect. Wow, that was so cool. I didn't know Jake Glasky can make wings. Yeah, you learn something new every day. Did you learn anything new lately? I did. I always stop down to sales and service to buy food, but the last time I stopped down there, I realized they had a classroom in the back. So, I decided to see what it was all about. Besides selling snacks, do you know what else they do in sales and service? The sales and service class helps students with learning disabilities prepare and find jobs by interning at different job sites. Sales and service senior Vernon Rose talks about how the program has helped him develop. Pretty much I restock and either do um, cash register and get people checked in and help out. The class has helped him be more social. I'm more of an introvert, so I'll never be out around people or talk to people or like that. You know, I think it's more bringing me more social than anything. Senior Tyree Hogerbrook talks about how this class is different than his homeschool. Well, I like it kind of more here better because I learn more stuff. I feel like I can actually do stuff that I want to do, like actually experience new things, actually help me out with life. He has learned to work harder through this program. The thing I like about this year, though, I feel like it's more harder this year than it was last year. Last year was more, you know, single work and stuff like that. It was kind of simple, but now like this year, it's like everybody for themselves. So you ready, you like, you work hard or you don't. But still learn more, you learn by your mistakes. If you don't know what you're doing, you learn by your mistakes. Then you know not to do it again. Make sure you stop down at sales and service to say hi. And maybe even pick up a snack while you're down there.
Miguel Mason Murdoch, CVCC Connect. Oh, that was a nice story, Miguel. Yeah, it reminded me of all the times my dad told me to get off my butt and get a real job. Well, that's all the time we have for this CVCC Connect. Check us out at www.cvccworks.edu. See you next time.